Now let me go quickly into the computer. I'm going to open DaVinci Resolve. And let me actually open a project that I've already edited. Let's say this project with slow motion. And I'm going to show you actually in DaVinci Resolve on how to check if your lighting is good. Because what we see on the screen, it's not what we see in real life. It's totally different. For this, go to DaVinci Resolve, go into your color page, okay? And go to your clip, okay, to your A roll here. All right, so here we have my clip over here. And in order to check if the light is correct, you have to open the waveform. You see, come over here. You see, you've got parade, waveform, vector scope, histogram, and all that stuff. In order to see where your light is sitting, you have to go to the waveform. And now, see what's happening now. If I go to this knob over here, to primary color wheels, look what's happening. If I go to my shadows, you see, if I drag this to the left or to the right, let me drag it to the left. You see, my shadows go down. You see? My shadows go down, as you can see here, they're all below zero. No shadow should be going below zero. So you have to go here again and drag it to the right until nothing is touching zero. You see, somewhere like this is fine. You see straight away, you see there are a lot of details everywhere. You see, even if it's dark and moody, you can still see the details, okay? But if I go back again and get this there, you see here, there's no information. It's just dark. You see, there's no information there. So make sure you always keep this just below zero. You see, even if some, some color here is going just touching zero, it's fine. It looks good on the screen, but don't go below zero. This is a good way for it. Same with the highlights, you see? Like nothing is clipping here. Don't get this go higher than this line. Normally it's going to be 100, but because this is shot in, um, in Vlog, I've got um, a lot more leeway here to play with the colors. But don't let it go more than the last line, okay? Keep it between the last and this line over here. So if I go here to my highlights and I get my highlights up, you see, all the colors are going up. And if I'm going to go more than the last line, you see everything is clipping. This light is clipped and this one looks too bright. Okay, so you have to make sure that your highlights don't go more than the last line. But also you can see how it looks like. Obviously, look at your skin, skin tone. Somewhere here, it looks perfect. But even, even this one is a bit too much. So I'm gonna go a bit lower. So keep it somewhere there, because I like my um, shot to be sort of like, you know, dark and moody a little bit. So this is a good shot. This looks good. So if I look at the waveform now, nothing is going below zero. It's just touching zero. But if I look on the screen, yeah, maybe there is a little bit too dark, but I like it. It's fine. Nothing is clipping. The highlights are in good shape. You see here. The light is there, see? This line over here, this is this line over there. Because obviously it's a light and it's supposed to be um, very bright. And uh, same with this one here, you see? If you got this lights here, they're clipping, then you know that these lights are these lights over here. And this is how I do it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found some value out of it. And you know, leave a comment below. Let me know what other videos and ideas you have for me and I'll make them. It will be my pleasure. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care and happy creation. Bye-bye.